windows once you go down You must be crazy if you think that I'ma slow down I wanna hear it talking shit from the drama Keep it coming up and send you to your mama It's the rip, rip, rip in the gun time Dropping bodies in the place till sun time Can't fuck with this, I'm doing it for hard Just the fuck with the fly, I'm the last one to die like, subscribe, and share. Follow us on the Patreon or the YouTube membership. Y'all, my deck is now in the Etsy virtual shop, so go ahead and check that out. The link is in the description box below. What is up you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I really and truly appreciate each and every one of you guys. We are going to go ahead and jump straight in to the reading for today. We're going to be checking in on your rival. For those of you who have rivals or the person who thinks that they're your rival, regardless of whether you think you are or not, I'm sure there's somebody here who is seeing your success and has tried to put their self in your lane. Anyways... For those of you who would like to be nosy on the situation, we're going to be checking how they view you, how they feel about you right now, how you're being viewed in this time by them, others, their next actions, all the things. Anyways, so let's go ahead and get into it. Let's see. How does your rival view you right now? I'm going to be pulling from a few of my different decks, my new deck that I had just gotten in today. So we're going <laughs> to, how they feel about you right now. They are stalking your ass. They're stalking you. Oh my God. I heard, let me see what I can see. Okay, so this person definitely uh, checks your social media accounts. Okay, what's well, not seen? You have the power. Now. Okay, so they do see you as powerful. They view you as powerful and there's something about, they almost feel like you may not even be of this world. Okay, um, ma definitely magical. Um, there's something about, I'm seeing... With that person, they're like opening a portal and going through a portal. So, they view you right now as being able to move through life a lot easier than they do. Or there's something about the way that you move through certain events is too easy. Okay, they're viewing you right now as... It's almost like you take a risk um, and you, you make it like... It's almost like you're making things out unscathed. They're confused by you. This person is confused by you, okay? They're very confused. They feel like you do have some kind of pull over the occult. And what I see on the bottom is looking like peace, okay? With this peace lily. I feel like this person wants some form of peace with you, okay? Um, <laughs> I feel like it's because of something that they may have done that was a little bit risky. I'm going to read these cards, though, for you. Look, and the moon out here twice. Okay, I guess I need to take them all because of, you know, it, it, it's going along too easily with this outside forces, the moon and the moon. This is how they're viewing you in this time, okay? Um, how your rival is viewing you in this time. All right, it says, outside forces, unknown figures are driving the situation and you may not be able to control the outcome. This cycle will shift soon and you will be okay. Roll the dice. Time to put yourself out there. You are hiding your talents and it is time to take a risk and step into the spotlight now. Um, looking. It's okay to look for better work. Uh, be discreet in your research. You need to be realigned with your life's purpose to be fully satisfied. Magic. You have the power now. Now, use your magic to attract what you want into your life. The sky is the limit. Dude. Okay. So, <laughs> your stalker, um, your rival, has definitely been on your social media accounts. Okay? Definitely. If you were curious as to know if they have been, they most definitely have been. They see you as lucky. Okay? They see you as um, making certain things happen that most people cannot make happen. And this definitely, it looks like they're worried about it, okay? Maybe they've done something to you or sent something your way, you know, that they shouldn't have before they had known the facts. Or maybe they didn't know enough about you um, before they started, I heard barking up the wrong tree. So, somebody may have decided to bark up the wrong tree. And as they were going through some of your information or whatever they were finding, I feel like it starts, it's starting to make whoever this is nervous. They rolled the dice with you and they're recognizing in this time that you have some form of, 
I heard a key, but there's like outside forces that are aligned with you to make sure that you stay in a state of peace. Okay. This is definitely given like if this person, whoever this is, if they are into the occult, they have done some digging. Okay. This person has gotten readings done on you. And I feel like, um, this person has, uh, learned that you're actually very well protected. Okay. Uh, I don't think they were aware of this previously. So if they've done stupid stuff, I heard win, um, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. So I feel like this individual may be winning a stupid prize in this time. And I do feel like this person is wanting to move into an energy of peace. Okay, with the peace lilies on the bottom. Or maybe they're seeing you, they're looking at you as a very peaceful person. I heard don't start no shit won't be no shit. So maybe that's the energy you come with. Don't start no shit won't be no shit. And this person is recognizing that they should have, I guess, taken the time out um, to do more research into you before they had acted or something of that nature. I feel like somebody definitely leaked before they looked with you. Okay. And now all they can do is look because it's like things are happening for you and around you that do not make sense to a specific person who has taken it upon themselves to make you their rival. Okay. Um, I feel like there is some kind of like worry that is surrounding this person in this time because of what they're finding out. Okay. Um, I feel like they, they're, and what's crazy is I don't even feel like they're really scratching the surface with you. Okay. I feel like they're trying to, but it's like every time they feel like they get close, you go through another portal or another ascension, another level of ascension. Okay. So for those of you who have had a rival who has been doing the most to her thwart your efforts. Okay. So if there's been somebody trying to thwart your efforts, they are getting stopped at every turn. Okay. Um, I feel like they're trying to look for a new way to, I guess, affect you or cause some kind of change, um, whatever they're trying to get uh, to happen, they know it's risky. They know it's risky with you because it's like every time they think that they know something about you, you open another door or you go through another portal. This person does not even think you're human. <laughs> to be completely honest, this person does not think you're human, okay? Um, and I feel like this is also kind of scaring this individual about all the things that they do not know, okay, about you. So there's somebody here who has been watching you very closely. And I don't know if you're getting, you get the kind of um, opportunities that most people don't get, all right? And there's somebody here who is observing this in this time. It's like they get close, you go through another portal, the portal closes behind you and they cannot follow, okay? So it's definitely given ascension. Um, this person is definitely intrigued, okay? You have a rival who is very intrigued with you. And the look, intrigued with you, your talents, okay? If you're wondering if they, they definitely see your talents, okay? And they feel like you are a star. They don't understand how you get the opportunities that you get, but it's like, um... There's something about a cycle, okay? I feel like I, I have a hard time telling you that this person is going to want peace with you because I feel like if they're a rival, they're a rival for a reason, okay? Or they, they're trying to be a rival for a reason. Because what's not seen is the lilies, the peace lily, calm, peace, serenity, okay? I feel like this person feels like there's a lot that they could actually learn from you because of the like you have another level of power to you that this person does not understand so whether you are the top who manifest through you know occult practices or you are the type who you can speak things into existence or your affirmations are on point and you bring those things in okay this person is definitely watching you your rival is watching you and they view you as being someone who they could actually learn from ain't that crazy ain't that crazy and they want to they are watching heavily okay let me see how they actually feel about you though and they know i feel like this person also knows it's risky to watch you as well okay where's where did that go okay so let's see how does your rival actually feel about you 
How does your rival feel about you? Okay, let's see. Why is it still giving crystal ball energy? They feel like you see things before it happens. You have the gift of foresight. How do they feel about you? Plan for the future while living in the present. You are always supported by spirit. Your psychic abilities can bring you prosperity. <laughs> Same thing. How do they feel about you moving up? You are um, increasing your power and status. You may get a promotion or move to a better home or office. You climb the ladder of success. <laughs> Some of y'all, this rival of yours you work with, okay? Um, and as far as their feelings for you, it's like they feel like, I heard you're going to get to the top either way, okay? Um, I don't see that. As, that's not right. Okay, this bitch is crazy in the past. That makes sense. Now, that makes sense. Okay, so how they feel about you. I think they are attached to the way that things used to be in the past, whether they may have looked like they were more powerful than, powerful than you in the past, or maybe y'all were on equal playing fields in the past. Um, how they feel about you, though? How does a rival feel about you? Oh, you're controlling. They feel like you're controlling. How do they feel about you? Okay, so... They feel like you're sneaky, you're controlling, and they miss when they were the one who had more control over the dynamic between the two of you, okay, or the dynamic period, okay? So, they also feel like what whatever you are engaging in in this time does not involve them, that you will cut them out because of your rise to power or rise to fame. This is how they feel about you, okay? They feel like you are deceptive, okay? They feel like you plan ahead. They plan, they feel like you plan your deceit ahead, okay? Your deceit and plan, like your control, but your controlling mechanisms and your deceit, they feel like you plan ahead to get ahead look of them they i know that they want control they know that they're gonna whoever this is they know that you are cutting them out or they know that you will cut them out okay um they feel like you're very dominating all right regardless of whether you actually are or not they feel like you're de de oh my goodness can i speak they don't want me to express their feelings towards you they see you as being deceptive and for those of you who do have foresight, you use that to move up, um, to control a situation, to control dynamics, to be, to remain in control. Um, you do deceptive things to remain in control. That's how they feel about you. Okay. And they miss the way that things were in the past, possibly before some kind of advancement that you received, um, maybe a public advancement that you had received. Let's see, how is your rival being viewed in this time by others? How is your rival being viewed in this time by others? The scissors tried to come out like they've been cut out. How is your rival being viewed in this time by others? Let me not have that blend in the flames. It says adventure. You make exciting work moves that could take you outdoors or on a trip. You will need to climb steadily to reach your financial goals. Okay. Let's see. How do... How is your rival being viewed by others in this time? I heard in and out, back and forth. Okay. And then we've got innovation. You will need to come up with new strategies to keep your plans in motion. Old ways are outdated. Invent, create, and... Uh, test ideas okay so uh people are viewing your rival in this time as having old ways of thinking outdated ways of thinking that they need to you know expand their horizons okay what's on the bottom is in the flow the universe is sending you help tap into your inner power and go deep to create the purposeful life that you really want to have okay so uh, people are viewing this person in this time as, I heard touchy, touchy, touchy. So this person may be touchy. 
Okay, um, they may be a little bit explosive if um, things don't go their way as well. Like, I feel like there's some kind of shock. Okay, this person may have done something shocking or they may do something shocking because they have in their head only one way, only one way, only one way. And it's an old, an old way of thinking. Okay, so the people around this person viewed your rival as somebody here who needs to think outside the box or think bigger, bitch. <laughs> think bigger, bitch. <laughs> um, even their friends or the people who work with them or other co-workers are seeing them as, you know, needing to oil up, spruce up, or change a formula that is no longer working. Okay, I feel like the people around them are seeing, it's like you're working harder, not smarter. Why are you doing this? It's like cutting off your nose to spite your face. That's how they're viewing your rival. How are other people viewing your rival in this time? It's like, yeah, they may be adventurous and want to do things, but they want to do it the hard way. Okay, we've got 28 and then 43. Look, a lot of people think this way too, okay? I heard... Yeah, y'all think that, but you ain't gonna say it to my face, okay? So, maybe this is what's going on. Yeah, because of how explosive they are. The reason people don't say this to this person's face is because they know that it will make more challenges instead of, you know, working harder. Other people like to work smarter. The people that they work with want to work smarter. They know that they're not even going to deal with, like, they don't want to deal with what this person is going to say, the backlash that they're going to get if they were to even speak up to this person, okay? Because in this deck, 28 minus 7 would be 21. 21 is challenges. It's like obstacles, mountains, unnecessary shit, a hard drama, so... Um, I feel like this person create would create a mountain out of a molehill and more work for the office or more work for other people if someone was to speak up on it, okay? This is why the people don't say anything about it, but the people in the office or who work with this individual um, see that this person is the type of person to cut off their nose to spite their face, all right? They do not, they, they're not, I'm not going to say they're not smart, but I mean, some of them, they're not smart. Um, and I, what I'm getting is this is public knowledge that is known about this individual. So other people view them as working harder, not smarter. Okay. And causing issues to the flow of things. Like they, they're not the type to go with the flow. Like if something's working, they don't care. <laughs> the uh, people around them see that like uh, they, they don't care if it's not working, they're going to continue to do the thing that does not work. Okay, and other people see that they're making things harder. Okay, let's see. How are those same people viewing you in this time? How are those same people viewing you in this time? Ooh, that was way too many. Look, y'all, do y'all work in the same field? Okay, how do they view you in this time? How do they view you in this time? The same people, how do they view you in this time? money matters okay look i heard if it don't make dollars it don't make sense so you do things that make sense <laughs> you do things that make sense okay there's something about that so the same people view you as okay and i heard an overflowing of abundance you are not in a poverty mindset mindset this person the other person is thinking okay so the people around you, the same people who are looking at that competitor of yours or rival of yours, they see you as being adventurous, being smart, okay? Um, and it's like you do what makes sense, okay? You're on a path to success, and I feel like they also see you as someone who doesn't feel like you can't take others to the top with you. Whoever your rival is is the exact opposite, and they work against the flow. You go where the money goes is what it looks like. Okay. So these same people um, view you as adventurous. It says you make exciting moves, work moves that could take you outdoors or on a trip. You will need to climb steadily to reach your financial goals along with money matters. Money matters a lot now. Watch your expenses and save up for the future. You need to be prepared for the unexpected, but what's not seen is success. The path you are on will bring you success and prosperity if you just keep going. Lots of little steps take you a long way. You're on track. So people view you the same people people view you as actually being on the right track okay you may have done certain things that were outside of the norm 
look, you're adventurous, but you're open-minded. There's something about that. You've done things outside of the norm. Um, people may have talked a lot about that, the way that you handled things or the way that you did things. But what's really crazy, um, 42 minus 12, that is 30. That was peace that uh, that came out earlier, that peace lily, okay, calm, peaceful. People see you as, even in the face of adversity, you can handle communication. You're actually a very successful communicator. And it's like you are an innovative thinker, successful communicator. You may do things against the grain, but it's like whatever you're doing, if it don't make sense, you're not doing it, okay? So the people, if you are wondering how the same people who are in the same environment or whatever are viewing you as opposed to this individual, they see that you do what makes sense, all right? Even in the face of adversity, I'm right. Let's see what your rival's next actions are towards you. And that's what we really need to see. What is this rival's next actions towards you? <sighs> Look, didn't we say innovation, innovative thinking, innovation, gift, hmm? Hmm. power position. You got some kind of promotion. And this is the only reason why this person is offering you anything. <laughs> Let me tell you this. This is the only reason they are offering you anything. But they are going to give you something. Okay. Um, it says innovation. You will need to come up with new strategies to keep your plans in motion. Always or outdated. Invent, create, and test ideas along with gifts. You are uncovering new talents that will land you new work. In a better position, you could get more money with the deal. Uh, with this, with the deal as well. Underneath that was not seen as power position. You are being promoted or called to lead. Time to step into your sovereignty and guide others with compassion. That's crazy. Oh, they're about to try to rise to the occasion. I see. So, what is your rival's next actions towards you? I have a hard time uh, believing this one right here. I'm going to lie to you, but we're going we're gonna to keep going. What the hell? This is commitment. Your rival's next actions towards you is commitment and loyalty. Giving you a gift. I know they're not giving you no damn puppy. I know they're not. <laughs> but I definitely see... Um, that this person is shifting in this time. They may be going through something to where they are actually going to give up a contract or give up something that maybe they saw as a prized possession before because they're recognizing that they it's too much work. Okay, they made something harder than it needed to be. And I feel like you have risen to the occasion. I feel like you are actually being seen in a very positive light and they are being seen. I heard as a bitch. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look, I said that and now I got to look. I got to look because I know that 25 minus 18 is 7 and I'm pretty sure 7 is the snake. So, <sighs> I know it is. I feel like I ain't got to look for it. I know it's the snake. <laughs> What's their next actions towards you? Okay, so. I just, what the hell are they about to try to give you? It looks like they're going to try to act like they're loyalty, but they're loyal to you or they're loyal. They're going to try to show loyalty or that they, they're going to try to, they're a bitch. Like, I feel like their mouth is still running now. Okay. This person's mouth is like, like they talk mad shit all the time, but it's like they're a bitch. Whoever it is, they're, they're a bitch. Okay. Um, they're going to try to show up and act like they recognize uh, the position that you... Like, they they feel like the only way for them to regain any kind of, like, face because of whatever has just taken place is to show up and be generous. More generous of their energy. More generous. They may, like, if they're in your office, they may actually leave something on your desk. Okay? So, I would be careful with... I don't trust nothing. Okay, I don't trust nothing that this person is going to give you, but it looks like they're going to try to show up in a completely different manner. But you need to know they still are here talking mad shit. Okay, um, they're still a little salty about maybe where everybody else's loyalties are in this time. Um, and I feel like this is their next power move. The next power move that they have, okay, is 
by showing up in a different light or trying to show up in a different light. Because I, I'm hearing them try to say that they can change, but they really, whoever this is, they cannot change. Okay, but they're going to try to act like they're on board with whatever this this change is, but they're definitely not. Okay, let me ask, is this person still talking about you? <laughs> Are they still talking about you? Like, I feel like maybe your character has already looked, not maybe, I, we already saw your character out here of how you're being viewed. Is this person going to keep talking about you? renewal you need to take time to recharge your energy now nah, they know they got to cut something out i feel like whatever position that you just got is something that they they can't like whatever you have just done they can't keep running their mouth i feel like they want to though <laughs> they want to but they can't um with renewal cut ties and flexibility is this person going to keep you know talking about you running their mouth about you Peace Lily came out again. You're about to see a completely different side of this person that's possibly even going to shock you. And you're going to be like, you fake as fuck, boy. Okay? With this, what's not seen is the obstacles and challenges. This person is trying to overcome those. And they are going to give you a gift because 30 minus 21 is 9. And 9 is also flowers. So, they may be bringing flowers to you or showing up in a very gentle way. And this is not what you're used to with this person. <laughs> okay so we've got renewal you need to take time to recharge your energy to get back on track challenges ahead require you to have faith and breakthrough cutting ties you may need to leave your current position and look for something better ending a job doesn't mean burning bridges go with grace they're trying to bow out with grace what's not seen is flexibility you'll need to see in the dark to maneuver the coming changes while it seems extreme just hang in there this too shall pass okay so for some of you i told you they're going to give you a gift okay so if they didn't win something they know people are against them in this time and you know this as well this person is going to be bowing out of they're going to try to save face bow out peacefully gracefully trying to act like it's you know their choice my left hand started itching so bad um, and this was a seeing like, um, look, are they going to continue to run their mouth? They can't. They have to stop. They have to stop it. Okay. Um, I feel like uh, <laughs> this person, they may actually, because they have to stop some kind of repetitive behavior, causing challenges, making things harder for people, they're getting cut. Okay. They're getting cut. Um Maybe their hours are getting cut. Their pay is getting cut. Their, look, their pay is getting cut. My left hand is itching. I'm telling you. Okay. Um, they can't talk about you. Well, if you're the boss now, I guess they really better get... You may be firing them. Okay. Um, but there's some kind of obstacle that they're reaching every time that they try to run their mouth about you because they're getting basically cut down to size. They may actually leave the job, leave the position, and that's why they're gifting you something. They may be gifting your you their key, okay? Since you're the manager, they may be giving you the key, like, here, here. Like, not because they want to, but, you know, because they, they're not, they're not, they don't want to be here to see your success. They don't want to be here to, um see you changing the company or making certain changes and things running smoother you know now that they're not in a place of power or something like that somebody lost power okay and they may actually be losing power somebody's lots may have just got cut off as well random side note <laughs> look is that every look that's probably why <laughs> that's so funny every time this person starts running their mouth about you they lose finances in some type of way and they, that's why they sitting there looking at you like hold the fuck up who is this this isn't real this ain't right look favor ain't fair i'm telling you okay um i don't feel like they're gonna keep running their mouth look do, does this person talk about you to anybody else does this person talk about you to anybody else? Okay, so what we got? The future. Plan for the future while living in the present. You are always supported by spirit. Your psychic abilities can bring you prosperity along with harmony. It's important for you to have a quiet, peaceful work atmosphere order in order for you to thrive, working at home or for yourself is best. <laughs> Look, they gonna be 
mm, 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 what's not seen is real passion. Stop wasting your time in a dead-end job and find your true passion. It's fine to experiment, but don't settle for less than you truly deserve. So, I feel like this person is about to... Look, this is probably what's being eclipsed out of your energy, out of your environment. This person is, like, going to start looking for love, okay? Um, maybe they see that you're in a place of peace because of something that, you know, you stayed on top of things. You shifted in the way that you were supposed to shift. And I don't feel like this person... They don't want to... They want to look for the future, okay? They want to find peace. They want to find, you know... I heard the real thing. So, some of them may be looking for love. I heard looking for love in all the wrong places, okay? They may have exposed themselves that they're crazy or that they are loud, obnoxious. They do things in the wrong way. There's something that is being observed by a lot of people. And I feel like the people that they've already kind of like run to and I heard run and tell that homeboy or something like that. Okay. The people that they've run and, you know, run off and said all the things to, I don't feel like anybody takes them seriously. It looks like they're seen as somebody who is on like they'll jump on anything that they can it's really what it's looking like okay and i don't feel like this person has any kind of pull if that's what you are worried about this person has no pull okay and it's like they are making a choice in this time to switch things up um but i don't feel like you're actually gonna see a whole lot of them in the future because i feel like they've made a mess where they are now they want love okay i don't know very strange especially if this is somebody that you work with maybe they're going to start prior prioritizing their relationships um but i don't see them as wanting to talk about you it's like they're wanting to find peace in their life anyways that is what i'm seeing for you guys love you so very much and i will see you guys later bye